Uh, what would you like for Christmas, Victoria? A pony with a diamond lined saddle. A pony with a diamond lined saddle. The problem with animals, we have to check with the parents. And what can I do for you? I want a swimming pool for Christmas. A swimming pool for Christmas. The problem with the swimming pool. I can't fit it in the sleigh. I really, really want a baby brother. You really want a baby brother? Well, the problem about that, you got to talk to mom and dad. Santa can't help. Coach Dre Slay, I repeat, Coach Dre Slay. That's Golden Globe nominee Eric Roberts starring in the holiday film Santa's Boot Camp. The movie was directed by local film director Ken Feinberg, who joins us this morning with one of the stars of the movie, Madison Thompson. And this is really one of those movies, you know, I have nieces and nephews, and they ask for what they want for Christmas, but this really has kind of a message that maybe it's not so much about what you want for Christmas or about being grateful for what you get. Absolutely. Uh, when we started this film, we wanted to make a film where we could have a positive message because a lot of times kids don't get positive messages. We want to think of a little bit more than what the, who they are and what, what they want as opposed to who they are in the world and how they can, how they can cooperate with others and, and help others and be helpful in that way. And Madison, you play the tech elf. I can already tell you're very tech savvy because oh, we were just taking you. selfies. Yes. But tell me a little bit, what went into that role? Um, well, it was a great role to play because it was very close to someone that I am, but it was super cool. My character does all the behind the scenes work. She's very lo loyal to Santa and stays with him when all the other elves revolt. So I do all the behind the scene works, deciding who's naughty or nice and all the cameras and such. And one of the great things about this film is that it was filmed here in right. Atlanta mm -hmm. and it stars a lot of people from Atlanta. Right. So tell me a little bit about filming here in Atlanta that's really become Hollywood mm. South. Mm. Well, as part of my actor training program, we make films every year so actors get experience being on film with what's expected of them. And so, uh, filming here in Atlanta, is, you know, people are very welcoming, very open. The crew we have was a local Atlanta crew. They're all excellent, outstanding crew people. They've worked on, you know, you name it, big shows, big movies here in town. And they came and worked on our little film, too. Um, it was really nice. We shot all over Atlanta. We shot at Johns Creek. We shot in Dunwoody. We shot uh, Stone Mountain Park. We shot at, at a goat farm near the airport. It was really nice. And Madison, being from Atlanta, what was it like to be able to kind of do this at home? Uh, this was actually the first movie I ever did. I started with Ken at Film Academy. And what's so great is that you get from knowing nothing about acting to being able to work on one of his movies. And so it was so cool to be able to do something in my own backyard and get an amazing set experience. And now I understand you guys have already won some awards for this film. We've won four awards. We've and we were named one of the top 10 f uh, films for teens in the UK, which is really cool. We won a uh, Director's Gold Award at the International Family Film Festival. We were named uh, Best Family Film at the San Diego International Kids Film Festival. And, and we're a uh, Dove Foundation Award for family-friendly content for all ages. And that's really one of the themes here is, is family, right? Yes, it's a film the whole family can watch together and have conversation about some of the themes afterwards because there's a lot going on in the film and you know, some of people said they've seen it more than two or three times and each time they watch it they find different things that makes me as a filmmaker feel really nice that they see more things. All right, so I know it's available on Amazon. Where else can people find it? You can find it on demand. Uh, Walmart should be carrying in stores. If it's not in Walmart, ask them to get it. Yes. Target, Barnes & Noble, all these places. You can watch it on iTunes. You can watch it on Google Play. It's all over the web. You can download it and watch it at home. Um, and, and you can order DVDs. And uh, yeah. Like this one. Like I'm that looking one. forward to watching it. All right, Ken, Madison, thank you so much for thank being you. here. Thank you for having us. And Good Day Atlanta continues after that.